Whoa, stop. Before you enter the workspace, you need to be wearing proper dress clothes. clothes. You can't need to have your hair tied back, uh, your loose strings removed, and take off your, your necklace and your baggy clothes. Make sure to identify any possible hazards within the workspace. Make sure all areas are clean before use. Oh, so I've got the Chuck key in here. Uh, if I were to turn the machine on, then the Chuck key would go flying and hit someone. Always announce before using power tools. Drill! Make sure there is a mentor present whenever using a power tool. Practical. What you don't want are uncovered wires that are not plugged in to avoid short circuits. Make sure the robot is turned off before working on it. Make sure to remove any sharp edges from freshly cut metal. Make sure to clean up all messes you make while working. When working in an environment like this, make sure to always wear safety glasses when necessary. Report all injuries to a mentor immediately. Make sure there is always a clear path through the workspace. Don't block anyone from getting to any place. Make sure everybody on the team knows what everybody else is doing. This helps with communication and further helps safety. Our team handles this by doing meetings at the beginning and end of each day. To quickly recap, follow the dress code. Always have a mentor around. Follow safety procedures for power tools. Watch out for any possible hazards. Keep your workspace clean. Work effectively and communicate well with your team. This is how you maintain a proper workshop environment and work well with your team.